my friends, my name is Shamim, and today we're gonna be reacting to the 14th episode of Attack on Titan. And the show is getting more and more interesting, so let's just jump into it. Yeah, they're questioning Aaron. What is he gonna answer? I wanna become a member of the Scouts. Yeah, that's a pretty good answer, Aaron. Wants to kill every Titan that crosses his path. Wow, Captain Levi is saying that it's not that he trusts Aaron, but it's that he trusts himself to take care of whatever happens. Hey! The opening change! That's good because I was singing that other one a lot. Yeah, now I have to actually learn how to sing. Well, not I'm never gonna learn how to sing this, but learn how to, you know, do whatever I was doing in the last episodes. I thought that openings change every season but I guess here in the middle of the season that they change the opening I don't know maybe changing openings every season only happens to American shows is that how it works I don't know I'm trying to remember to see if the other anime that I've seen also changed mid-season but I can't remember attack on Titan can't look into his eyes yet Eve of the counter-attack part one okay let's see what's gonna happen here Aaron? Waking up from his sleep? Oh, the people are discussing how while Rose has a Titan that's helping the humans. The military has a Titan on the team. Humanity has a savior. Wow. I guess the reactions of people differ a lot. Some people don't like it. Some people like it. But they're only rumors so far because they haven't actually announced anything officially. Although a lot of the soldiers do know about this. Who is this guy? Very important person. Here's Commander Pixis talking to this guy that I don't remember his name. Mm, the police Police plan to take custody of Aaron Yeager. Oh, the decision has been left to Premier Zachary. He's gonna be the person who's gonna decide. Dallas Zachary. Wow. So Aaron's life is dependent on the decision of this one guy. And the commander has no say in this. Well, none of them do. It's all up to one person. If it works or not will depend on how the debate unfolds. Hmm. Good luck, commander. Oh, Mikasa and Armin are talking about the debate. Wow, she got really upset at the thought of them not letting Aaron live. Oh, they're calling them. They're gonna act as witnesses for today. And Aaron's here, locked up. Does he even know about anything? He can't even go to the bathroom. He can't get water. Aaron's just stuck here with nothing. Huh, Aaron's saying that even he doesn't understand what's going on, so he can't blame them. I wonder what they're doing now. Uh, he's been here so long, he's thinking about whether he's gonna spend the rest of his life here. Wow! What is that face? Oh my god, that was creepy. Her face, she like disappeared there out of nowhere. He still has to be in chains though when he gets out. She's a section commander? Man, why are these guys so creepy? What? That guy sniffs people? That's weird. And this girl is acting like it's just nothing. Okay, they're already here. Hold on. What's happening? Oh, she said we've all put our faith in you, Aaron. Oh, wow. Look at all these people here that were waiting for Aaron to come. So he was in the basement of a courthouse. Why are all these people here? Aaron has no idea. Oh, but he saw his friends. Here's that guy. The premier. Aaron's fine out now that he is gonna decide if he lives or dies. Let us proceed. Choice must be made. So either way, they do have to publicly announce his existence. Military police will not present their case. Wow, that guy's saying that Aaron should be disposed of immediately. Oh, his mere existence has been creating rebellious sentiment. A wall cultist? What is that? Now the scouts are gonna propose their plan. He proposed the following. Oh yeah, reinstate him as a full member of the scouts. Yeah, I want, it. I want that. That is all. Okay, what happens now. Oh, and this guy's saying that when you say we can't afford, are you speaking for anyone else other than your merchant friends? Man, no one agrees with anyone. Oh, that guy's like obsessed with the wall. He respects the wall or something. All right, he has a question for Aaron. Oh, he's saying that this report contradicts that statement because he made the attempt to crush Mikasa. Oh, because this girl told the truth in the report, as she should, but now Mikasa has to answer whether this is true. What are you gonna say, Mikasa? Are you gonna say he actually attacked you? Yeah, all of that's true. And even Aaron didn't know it. What's happening to me? However, he also saved my life twice before. Yeah, it's difficult to tell. The problem is that he doesn't have much control over when he's actually able to control his thoughts when he's in Titan form. Oh, this guy's saying that personal feelings play a large part in her testimony. He does not trust that. Oh, they said that their investigation led to some shocking discovery. Oh, wow. He's saying that Mikasa and Aaron, when they were nine, they killed those three kids. Kidnappers. How did they even find out about that? Granted, they did that to defend themselves, but anyway, Aaron got really upset when they started accusing Mikasa. He's saying that they're so selfish in pushing their own agendas. Oh, he's gonna let them know exactly what he thinks. If you're too scared to fight, let me do it. You're all cowards. For a second, I thought he was even gonna become a Titan in court, but I guess he was just screaming. What? That guy kicked him. 
him! Come on, Captain Levi! Why is he kicking him? Oh my god. And they're doing this in a courthouse! Aaron's gonna, like, practically die because this guy is beating him up so much. Oh! But this guy's also making a point that if Aaron becomes an enemy, it's gonna be really dangerous because of his intelligence. But he could beat him up right here and nothing happened. So he's, like, proving that Aaron's not actually that dangerous if he is on their side. Oh, that guy's saying that Aaron should be placed under Captain Levi's supervision. Man, I think this is gonna work. And if he loses control, oh, then they'll definitely kill him. Oh, he's made his choice. I think it worked. That's what they're gonna go with. What's wrong with that girl? She was asking Aaron, does that hurt? Oh, yeah. Describe it to me. Does she like pain or something? Knock this tooth out. Yeah. <laughs> Captain Levi and Aaron. What a strange relationship Aaron is gonna have with other people now. He's in a really difficult position. Oh, your tooth? It grew back. His tooth grew back! No way! That is so cool! I have goosebumps right now! Oh my god! He can regenerate! He couldn't do that though when he was a titan! How is he like... It's so inconsistent the way he's getting his titan powers! But this is cool man, this is cool! Special Operations Squad, Eve of the Counter-Attack Part 2! Trust District, Old Scout Regiment Headquarters! Yeah, this is a pretty nice castle! Our former headquarters! But it was way too far for it to be practical! Okay, so what is Aaron doing here? What's his job here? Man, Captain Levi has such a serious look on his face. What happened? That guy was like, don't expect the royal treatment because whatever, whatever. And then he started bleeding. What? Yeah, what happened to him? Oh, he's trying to act like the captain. So here they are. Special Operations Squad. The Levi Squad. Wow. She's killed 10 Titans and assisted like 40 something times. So these are like the strongest people. Every one of them was handpicked by Captain Levi. They're his executioners. If he messes up, he's done. If he can't control that Titan form that he has. Alright, they're gonna clean this place up? What are they gonna do here though? That's the question. Aaron's done with the upstairs. What are you gonna work on next? Oh, Aaron's gonna sleep in the cellar. Wow, Captain Levi's saying that Aaron might go Titan in his sleep. So he's really, really cautious about this. Interesting. He's dealing with a very different group of people here. This girl's kinda calming Aaron down though. They're discussing Captain Levi's seriousness. Which I agree with, definitely. Oh, and then Captain Levi came back. What's going on? Hmm, interesting. So that girl was trying to befriend Aaron. They're having a little meeting here, drinking some tea or something. Oh, mission planning. Hmm, and everyone's looking at Aaron. They don't know how to deal with him. Oh, now he's asking, how does it work changing into Titan? Oh, that's interesting. He knows that the trigger becoming a Titan, he has to hurt himself. So like biting his hand, that's why he did it. And then he asked, why do I know this specific information, but not anything else? Which is very interesting interesting. Oh, here's that creepy girl from the other episode. Section Commander Hanji. She wants Aaron's help? She's so weird. And she's blushing now? Alright. She's gonna get his help. Even though he's kind of not reacting in any way. What is he gonna be doing? She's running experiments? <laughs> what is wrong with her? You possess a singularly curious mind, don't you? And everyone left. Um, maybe he shouldn't have said that? I don't know. Oh, she's gonna tell him. So she likes learning about titans. She's a titan scientist. Attempt at communication Communication. <laughs> She's like trying to talk to the Titans, but they're like trying to bite her. It's not going well. No communication seemed possible. But it could be that they just don't know how to speak English. There's also that. Like they could communicate in some other form that we don't know about. Are the Titans actually listening? Oh God. She's like describing all the foods. They're not foods. They're like, it's like, she's talking about cannibalism and it really, ugh. Ah! And all the other soldiers are like throwing up, disgusted by what she's saying. Victims of your own appetite. She named them? Is this, is this even gonna work? And they're both smiling. Denying them sunlight was the next step? She discovered a profound difference between the two. Oh, one of them got really weak, but the other one was still okay even three hours in. The only thing their bodies metabolize into energy is sunlight. So not food or water or anything like that. That's so weird, man. She's like naming all the different titans she was doing experiments with. <laughs> I must not let that happen again. And then Aaron's like, uh, oh yeah, sure. She is like disturbingly emotional about these experiments and these titans. Does she get attached to the titans and that's why she gets so sad about them? Hurting and dying? Oh wow, the girl was like trying to talk to the titan and it tried to eat her. And then she was so happy about it. <laughs> yeah, how can she be so lighthearted? Wow, they've nearly driven them to extinction, the humans. Yeah, so how does she have that attitude towards titans then? One day she came to a realization, she kicked the head, it weighed next to nothing. What? 
what? Wow. So even though they look like they're really heavy because they're huge and really strong, their separate body parts are really light. Their appearance stands in sharp contrast to their true selves? Huh. I guess we really don't know much about these titans after all. This is very interesting though. Even though this creepy passion that she has is kind of weird, it's still very interesting to learn all this stuff about titans. Commander Hanji, what is Aaron gonna say? Oh, Aaron wants to know everything. Yeah, I wonder why the other people didn't want to know about this. This is really interesting. Full disclosure. All right, she's gonna tell them everything. Wow, she told them everything. Took like the whole night. Aaron's so tired. Ugh. Oh, now she wants to review. <laughs> As if it wasn't enough. The test subjects. They're dead. Both of them killed. What happened? Wow, yeah. Both of the Titans got killed. Oh, and she is like so sad about it. She's freaking out. Oh, this is a soldier's work. They didn't just die. Someone actually killed them. Who did this? Why would they do it anyway? Man, there's so much we don't know about everything that's happening in this world. This is all a big mystery. Who do you think the real enemy is here? He's asking Aaron. What? Who is the real enemy? Who is the real enemy? Oh, man, that's a really good question. Who is the real enemy here? Hmm. Man, this show is getting really good. Really good. What needs to be done now? Eve of the counterattack part three. What is this paper? What are they doing? Now they can get into trouble for killing Titans? Oh yeah, cause they're trying to find the killer of those two Titans that lady was doing the experiments with. Huh, yeah I wonder who did that. And what would be the purpose of doing that? Oh, this guy's saying I'm glad they did it. Today they have to pick which regiment to join. Is he really gonna do what? We're wondering why we ever put on this uniform. We have to fight. But he's saying I'm not a suicidal maniac. Oh yeah. And he's remembering that guy saying that he's a good leader, but not because he's strong, because he's scared out of his mind like everyone else. He's sympathetic to everyone. Have they decided which regiment they're gonna join? He's made his choice. Oh, he's gonna join the scouts. And what about Armin? What is he gonna choose? He's decided that? Oh, yeah. He's gonna join the scouts. Oh, and he said, I'm beginning to suspect you care more than you let on. She cares more than she actually shows. Yeah, who could have done it? And even Aaron's not sure of who is gonna join the scouts. Good morning, Captain! Captain. So Aaron has to stay close to Captain Levi at all times. Otherwise, he has to be in a cell. What is happening here? Are they waiting for something? Yeah, John is joining the scouts. All right, it's time for them to make their choice. Aaron has proven his loyalty to this cause. Another problem must be dealt with. They have to retake Walmaria. 60% in four years. That's how much they've lost. Wow. This guy estimates that a third of them are gonna die. Man, this is... Difficult decision. Whoever still wants to join the cadets will remain here. Can you give everything to humanity? Is what this guy's saying. Oh, and the guy said that the commander intimidated all the cadets. None of them are gonna stick around. Wow, look at them all going. Pretty much no one is sticking around. There's only a few people. And the ones that are not walking away are really nervous. And they're like, ah, oh, should I really, I could just leave now. Should I go or not? Wow, look at the struggle in their faces. Thinking about having to face Titans again. What a difficult decision. Decision to make some piano music playing this little group stayed together we give our hearts wow man that must have been like the most difficult decision they've ever made in their lives they're on the verge of crying wow the commander said each one of you has my respect it's interesting attention their training began the next day hmm they have to memorize this formation but Aaron's position is unclear oh Aaron's gonna be in the safest position in the whole formation all right this is gonna be a test run oh yeah what did the commander mean by the real enemy? Oh, it's possible that this entire operation has a different goal, but that they're not actually telling everyone. Man, that question though, who is the real enemy? Oh, Aaron met up with Mikasa and Armin. Aw, and Mikasa's all concerned about him. Aw, everyone's so happy to see Aaron. Yep, they all joined the scouts. That's right, Aaron. Oh, yeah, Marco is dead. Oh, their uniforms are here. They have officially joined now. The green uniforms. Aaron looks really concerned. Yeah, they're all going to be in this operation. It's cool that Aaron can at least meet up with his friends though. Yeah, he doesn't have full control of being a titan. Apparently he tried to attack Mikasa and he doesn't even remember it. Oh, Jean is asking for the truth. What we want is a guarantee from Aaron. Make us believe that you're worth dying for. What is Aaron going to do? How can he do that? The bell's ringing? What is happening now? Oh, they're going to start the plan. Everyone's in their positions. Oh, and look at the kids. Oh, the kids are looking at the scouts. Really amazed. Wow, it's them. Yeah, let's show the Titans what we're made of. Oh, oh. 
All right, they're gonna open the gate. This is it, guys. This is happening. All right, let's move it. It's officially begun. Wow, you're getting started. <laughs> of Attack on Titan. If you enjoyed this reaction, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe so that you get notified for the new videos that I make. New videos are coming out every single day. Every day, guys! So make sure to subscribe. Just do it! Alright, my friends, my name is Shami, and I'll see you in the next video.